on board here, board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> What? Wait, what are you talking about? War, you know you can't participate in the sports festival. Why? Because you will destroy the competition. So? You still don't know how to fully control your powers yet. <laughs> <laughs> and you do? You remember what happened last time. <sighs> okay, fine. So, what am I supposed to do? Observe? Be bored and jealous or some BS? No. There is actually something you can do. Oh yeah. If anything, we do need some help when it comes to this hero killer. Hero. I'm sorry, hero killer? Yes. <sighs> you gotta be kidding me. I am not, no. So let me get this straight. You want me to help the heroes catch someone who's killing heroes you want a student to do that do you really think oh don't bullshit me uh. okay war we do need your help I'm going to be busy with the sports festival so they need another guy there. That's that's some bullshit. You know that, bro. Yes. If everyone else had the capabilities of you. Uh, okay, okay. <sighs> so, I find this hero killer and I... No. What? You were just supposed to apprehend him, and that is all. <sighs> okay, um. Let's see. Who am I gonna be doing this with? Excuse me. I mean, technically, I'm not supposed to use my quirk out in public without supervision. So, who's gonna be my chaperone? Hmm. That's a good question. You haven't even thought of anyone? Of course not. I was just going to say you're out there solo. Oh, man, you're at yeah, times. <laughs> Don't make me have to cut off your arm again. <laughs> yeah. I'd rather that not happen this time, so. You got a plan or something? Yes. You go out there, patrol, and bring back the hero killer. Not much of a plan, though, is it? Trust me, I would have a more well thought plan if they were anyone but you. As much. Punishment if you was taken. I mean, you were skewered. Yeah, but then you saved me. Well, you're, technically, you're not fully awakened, so. 
like at the very least. <sighs> okay, fine, whatever. Good. Now, at the very least, call in sick or something. What? Uh, you, you seem to really have very little faith in people's intelligence. What? Me getting sick. What are the odds of that ever happening? Especially now. Huh. Yeah. Didn't think about that, did you? I'm stronger. Faster. I can use my power a lot more, all these considered. You're right about that. Perhaps there is some alterations to the plan. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. Either way, I understand. Good. Very good. As yeah, Izuku is out <laughs> because of the whole yeah, sports festival. Which everyone else is pretty much happy about, considering that yeah he's a lot more capable, and Bongo is pretty much. Whew. Thank goodness. Hmm. hmm. But seriously, why isn't he? Ah, I'll, I'll just take whatever blessing I can get. So, yeah, everything goes similar to canon, except Yuzuku's not there, so no big kaboom, and it's pretty much, let's just say, just subtract Yuzuku, and that's pretty much how it goes. While Yuzuku hunting down Stain, it's pretty much boring as all hell, as you would expect. Until he actually does run to Ingenium, in which she's like, What are you doing here? Oh. Looking for a hero killer. Why? I, um, I was exempt from the sports festival, so. Why? I don't know. I become too strong. But wouldn't that be a good thing? I understand what you're saying. I agree with you. But still. Yeah, it's bad enough that I couldn't participate. Don't make this any worse for me. Understood. Now. So, uh, you wanna go patrolling with me? Sure. But... Are, are you sure you want me? Uh, of course. If anything, it'll be good to have someone watch my back. As they instantly run into Stain. One thing is, since the GM is not alone, Stain has a tougher time. And, uh, yeah, Izuku is itching for a fight right now. Stain does criticize them, saying that they are not true heroes of his cause is justified, but Izuku is doing that Chano no jutsu as well as like I understand why you're doing what you're doing but which, the methods you're using might have the opposite effect or a worse effect as yes, as they are fighting say he's trying to at least graze Izuku, get, get at least one drop of blood, but it's not working at all. And Genium is pretty much barely keeping up with both of them. So they still have plenty of time to talk before one gets over on the other. If anything, Stain starts listening to Izuku, seeing that, oh wait. Yeah, there are two ways, this, two to three ways this can go. One, People are too scared or worried about being personally attacked to be heroes. You know, they are true heroes. Two, 
they'll start giving away hero licenses like their candy at Halloween. Or <laughs> three. Yeah, I don't know where you got to worry about three. So yeah, say he stops. Izuku just standing there. So, what's the what's the move? What you gonna do next? <sighs> yeah. You alright, Aizawa? Hmm. Oh yeah. Yes. Yeah. I'm just a little bored. Bored? How could you say that? <laughs> the, the fights we've seen, the the uses of quirks that were displayed. It's like, uh, I'm a real warrior. What? I mean, a uh, hero. So, <laughs> that's way more exciting than this. But come on, these people could be future heroes. Eh, I guess. Well, the odds of that are slim already. <sighs> I should just take a nap or something. As then he's just wondering, okay, I wonder how war's doing. As yes, this is pretty much when he gets a call on his phone. Was it? Yeah, we got him. Really? Yeah. Huh? You hurt? No, no, not at all. Actually, Jenkins with me. If anything, I was thinking about keeping more of a low profile, just giving him the credit and everything. I don't really need it, especially considering, heck, I'm still a STUDENT! WHAT?! Stain just... Oh. Wait, you didn't know that? NO! You're a student! Yes. I lost a student? Of you, eh? A kid? I lost to a child? Well, I mean, technically he surrendered. That was even... Uh, whatever. I made my choice already, so might as well live with it. Now that is a very mature way of seeing this. Don't you dare patronize me, boy. Hey. Don't forget, I can still whoop you. You couldn't even get a cut on me. <sighs> yeah. Don't remind me. Oh, no, I'm going to remind you. Oh. oh, yeah, I'm doing that just out of spite. But. <sighs> I both disappoint myself. Yes, you did. So. Let's see what shall happen to you. What do you think, GM? If anything, he's killed enough heroes to be sent to Tartarus as well. I mean, he's gonna have a lengthy sentence and all things considered. <sighs> Sometimes I regret my choices. Well, oh, too late to regret them now. Uh, <laughs> yep, you should have thought of that before you decided to be a, the hero killer. Yeah, I see them now. But if anything, at least it's not all bad. Really? Yeah, it seems like this new world isn't completely doomed. You seem like a capable worthy hero. <laughs> Why thank you. As yeah, and JM does get most of the credit. The only thing is he's pretty much like I had this young man help me. So he does get some of the spotlight. Much to the pissed offness that is Bakugo and Ida. Not only did Izuku 
actually do some real hero work. He also got to team up with his brother, so that's just throwing more salt on the wound right there. But on the bright side, NJM can still be a hero. When it comes to Stain's interview and whatnot, he does explain his philosophy, but how this gener new generation of heroes seems alright. Just then name dropping is a good much to his you say annoyance, but also okay, good, I got some praise. Huh. I wonder who else would see that broadcast. Hmm. Either way. Let's cut back to the whole, uh, say, internships. Izuku does didn't get really offers, all things considered. He wasn't there, though he has been named dropped. And JM is pretty famous a hero to the point where, hell, it's a family name when it comes to the whole aspect. So he does get an offer from JM. The only thing is, Izuku would rather not. When it comes to like, Gran Torino, he doesn't. Hell, he, if anything, he's about the same build as All Might is, was at his younger years. If not, a bit bulkier. So, yes, Izuku can handle a lot more one for all. Only thing is, it's still kind of funny for him using this power. He has as all my did want it back again and again and again. All my say, I decided to give you that course so you've earned it. But just then, here comes one name so Miracle. As she is pretty much yelling and demanding that Izuku goes into an internship with her. In which she's like, why should I? Because I said so. Her grabbing him by the ear, him, that don't hurt at all. Until he sees a pink flame just spread out of nowhere and she gets nobody stronger to the point where he is saying ow and everyone else is looking like what did you just say Miracle just having a sly smile as she drags Izuku out of the classroom and yeah Aizawa he's pretty much of course of course of course it's her as he soon follows. In which, yes, it's pretty much Miracle yelling at Izuku, telling him to stop dragging his ass. As Aizawa is pretty much Fury. Uh, what? No, I'm more not you. Seeing the sly smile just creep upon her face. Wow. What took you so long? Oh. Please, I expected this. Oh, what? Of all the people who would get overly pissed over some of the most littlest of shit. It was either you or Buck Gokoski. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Okay, okay, that makes sense, yeah. I'm just surprised this idiot just pulling on Izuku's ear still just didn't really uh, click. The gears weren't turning, you could say. No kidding. I'm a little embarrassed. Oh. Hey, I've been busy. Yeah, embarrassing yourself. Uh, I, uh, uh. 
Listen. We need to find strife. Really? Don't be a smart ass. No, no, seriously. I I I was wondering who uh, who else was missing. I mean, us two. It's obvious. I mean, you. So, ugh. Of course, you. Do I need to rip off your ear now? Uh. <coughs> <coughs> Either way, so. Think about it. Who would Strife be? Hmm. If anything, he's more like a jokester. Someone who won't really take things seriously. Overconfident at times. No, it's not Bakugo Katsuki. I was not going to say that. Yes, you were. <sighs> if anything... I still can't believe you guys haven't noticed. Huh? Them turning their heads and they see Kaminari. It's like... What? <laughs> hey, guys. War? Death? Fury, you, the Pikachu, uh, wrong anime, oh, but still, really, how long have you, oh, I've been like this for a while, for anything, I've been waiting a fair amount of time, you're serious, yeah, yeah, if anything, I just found it interesting. I've been waiting for so long for the rest of you to wake up. I was worried I was going to die of old age before that happened. <laughs> oh, yeah. Cue laughing chuckles. Oh, no, don't worry, I will. Either way, it doesn't matter. Let's see, what shall we do here, hmm? Got any ideas? Well, I still plan on being a hero. That's still another, uh, you know, deep archives that is my mind. What about you two? We're already heroes. So if anything, I'm probably just going to keep doing what I do with beating up villains. Same. As well as teaching you idiots. Uh, just because you're the oldest does not mean... Oh no, it it definitely means I'm the boss of you. Not to mention I am the strongest out of all of us. Yeah, how did you get so strong? Think of it like this. I have soul magic. Soul manipulation and all the like. And you guys help. <sighs> That's better. Wait, where'd that, where'd that bone throne come from? Oh, I just conjured it. And bone throne, I like that. <laughs> Think of it like this. Everything that you guys are, this your war, fury, strife, all leads up to one inevitability. What? Me! Uh, wait, what? Yes, what happens in war? People die. What happens when someone gets angry enough and unleashes their fury? Someone has the potential to die, and sometimes it does happen. Strife. <laughs> you know what you do to people. Whatever. So, yeah, of course. Everyone's guaranteed to die. Yeah, either or, they come to me. Easy peasy.
Okay, okay, whatever. I think that's true. It is... <clears throat> Say that's true. I am war. I should be the strongest out of all of us. What? Think about it. Strife? Death? And fury? That can lead to me too. Hmm. Yes. S someone important dies. That could lead to war. If the and so on and so forth, huh? Do you think? Well, what about me? Yeah. And, and me. Then I'm just looking at, as I was, <sighs> You guys are idiots. Everything leads to me. You guys are just byproducts. Oh, these, eh. I'm the byproduct of you. Oh, and I get uh, the leftovers, technically. One thing is, is I am much more. Eh. If anything, let's just worry about doing our duty when it, the time comes. So, as any. One else has to deal with demons and angels. Hmm. I've had to deal with angels. Such snobby bastards. Nah, I just had to deal with demons. Or anything. You want to wear my skin as a mask. Sick bastards. Well, me as I was sensei, just call me by my name. War. There's no point in hiding it between ourselves. Well, me and Death were both summoned, in which we did have to deal with angels, but nothing too problematic. Oh, so you had a boring time? No, we we had demons to kill. Yeah, and this idiot died. What? Them just starting to laugh? Was like, okay, it was not my fault that I died. Oh, take some accountability. You should have been paying more attention. Uh, listen, it isn't my fault I died. It was just circumstances weren't the best for me. Yeah, 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 sounds like you're trying to make excuses. Wait, if you die, how come? Oh, I saved him. You sure that wasn't a waste of souls? Of course not, he's our brother. Besides, I won't want to wait till the seven seals were broken before he comes back. Plus, considering I am a school teacher, people would think weird that one of my students disappeared. Not to mention his mother. Huh. Mother. What is it? Death. Just thinking about Lilith. <sighs> Such a pain to deal with, but still. She, she may be our mother, but she is such a pain. A funny thing. I need to get something. We need to find a way back. Oh, I have no way back. Really? Yes. Seriously, I go there training just to kill some demons, probably murk some angels too. Fury, you don't have to. We, do, do you have any idea what big a waste of time that is? Why should I care? At all. Ugh. So irresponsible, and you 
will still want to lead us. I am the most intellectually uh, gifted out of the four of us. You can't deny that. Yeah, that's hearsay. If I think you are one of the most reckless <coughs> was well, it strife? Well, well, you forgetting the big ass elephant in the room? Uh, what? Just looking at you, like, oh, a war. Yeah, I don't remember any of us getting our limbs chopped off. Oh, uh, I. But at least my horse survived. How dare you! <laughs> yeah. What'd you guys say? As then, Mirko summons a whip, a chained whip, and wraps it around Izuku's neck and starts to strangle him. Izuku is pretty much gasping for air, saying, It was a joke! First thing, then this is gonna be the last joke you ever get to tell. Until those seals are broken. As yeah, Strife is pretty much laughing his ass off. Remember, Strife's coming already. As as I was, okay, I cannot keep bringing him back to life, so you're gonna have to cut it out. But well, tell his smart ass to say sorry. Or never. Okay, just make sure he's unconscious. Don't fully decapitate him. Fine. Only thing is, Izuku has got his head free, and she ends up doing no more damage. Especially when Izuku grabs her by the leg and starts to Hulk slam her. She's pissed, but also like, asshole. Takes one to know one. Hmm. But I must say, it is nice to have a hand. But still, where is our equipment? Oh, I just sewn this. Huh. What about your guns? Oh, yeah. I still haven't found them. Really? Yeah. The thing, I just didn't really care that much. Huh. Well, as that will. I, I mean, death has its sights. But my sword is gone. Oh, I have no earthly idea where it is, but. Uh, kind of hard to look in the other realm now, don't you think? Yeah, I suppose, but still, what are the odds? Hmm. What if we find a maker? What? <sighs> Come on, War, don't you remember the maker? Let's see. He told me that you challenged him once, or he challenged you, or something. I don't know. It I think you guys were either interrupted by angels or demons. Yep, it was, I believe it was the angels. Yeah, you said you guys got to a contest to see who could kill the most. Hmm. I believe that would be something I would possibly do, but still. What are the odds of makers here? Pretty good. All we need to do is know where to look. Uh, a maker. I haven't seen one of those in so long. No kidding. Let's see, what was the uh, son of a bitch's name? 
What was this? Oh, old thing, I believe it was. Huh. Yeah, yeah, you're right. He, I think it was old thing. Hmm. He was quite the character. <laughs> That's an understatement. If anything, he was stubborn, strong, very confident in his skills, all things considered. He sure as hell didn't fear her scary ass. <coughs> what? Hey, I'm not that scary. Uh, didn't you say you chased away humans? Or when you were going to save one, like old Dane asked, you scared the shit out of her before she decided to take a leap of faith with you? Nevertheless, it's still just, you know, whatever. If anything, he was interesting. I would like to see him again, but who knows if he's still around. Oh, believe me, he's still around. All we have to do is know where to look. As yes, they do go to this other plane of existence, in which they are quickly, you say, intercepted with a shit ton of these bloody demons. One thing is, Suku is pretty much like, okay, good. I get to redeem myself over this nonsense. Really? I, well, I, I, I would like to. At the very least, I just, you, whatever, just. Don't be a pain in the ass. Don't get in anyone's way. You know? Otherwise, I will take this whip and discipline you just like a dominatrix. What? Yeah, you heard me. I, I, uh, it, 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 I... Why, why are you stuttering like that? Remember, he's so fused with this Izuku Midoriya. So it only makes sense that... Oh. Oh. <laughs> are you serious? Oh, that's adorable. But if anything, you don't have to worry about it. Unless you like it. What? Oh, don't tell me you're actually a masochist. Is that why when it comes to taking damage you have no problem with it? Or is that a little something you got from Izuku Midoriya? Uh, I... Uh, uh, oh, this, oh, this is ridiculous. Please tell me. Please tell me you're not. No, it's just this kid does not, didn't really want to, you know, he was not very ex open for his experimenting. Hmm. Sounds boring. Uh, that, that he was, at least, all things considered, he never really had friends, really, so, yeah, 
Hmm. Very well. So, anything else you can tell me about all things? I'm still trying to wrap my head around some of these memories. Hmm. Okay, here's some, a little something more that I know about him. As then she's like, wait a minute, I just remembered. You pretended to be a human, helping humans, and you tricked me until it was too late. Huh? Yeah, I... I remember now. What? The Chard Council. Uh, what about them? They set you up, War. Wait, what? Yeah. I, I, I started to come back to me slowly, but surely. But yeah, I completely remember. At least enough. It was all a trick. To want you to take the fall for... What's his name? Uh, I think it was... Um, yeah. I lost it. Uh, it's fine, sister. No, no it's not, because... If anything, it was part of this plan, I forgot. Ah, it was an angel who thought of it. I think they wanted to, um, at the very least, something. I, I know they wanted to do something. Okay, well. Yeah, they wanted to get a head start on the the apocalypse so they destroyed all but one of the seals what yes I remember seriously I was tasked with going up against the sins putting them away and there was someone else uh, or hollows or something, I... Either way, I really, really got angry and... You are always angry. What makes this, these other times even more different? It's the fact that they tricked us. But... Yeah, the Lord of Hollows or something. He sacrificed himself for... Uh, he gave me this artifact thing, and I... <sighs> yeah, 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 I, I, I remember. I remember something. It, it heals me when I need it. I calm yourself, sister. No, don't you don't call. Tell me to calm down. That that makes it worse. <laughs> but in all seriousness, they they feared it. Hey, they demanded that I gave it to them, and boy, did I. What what? Oh, yeah. I got a glimpse of its power in which it protected me from the Chart Council. <sighs> I decided to save the humans. There was no hope for them. At least not on Earth. Not the way it was. What do you mean? All I know is it saved that thing, saved me, sigil, whatever it was. It was just. Wait. Oh, yeah. The talisman. 
of sin, I also... That is something I really need, and... The, there's the Flame Hollow. I think I still have that power, but... There's also the Force, the Storm, and the Stasis, I... What happened to those? Okay... Hey, don't, don't look at me like I'm crazy. I, I'm, we're not. It's just... Strange. How do you think I feel? Heck, all these... All these... Uh, memories. Some of them are mine. Others are part of this miracle woman. Seriously, it's <gasps> what? What? As then Mirko drops down, crying, yelling, the rampage. What? Don't tell me you're going to go crazy now. That like, no, like a. My companion, my horse. I forgot he's dead. What? Wait, you're. He's dead. Yes. Uh. Care to explain? See, I think the Charter Council had it done, but I, I, I have no proof. The only thing is, there was an angel's blade stabbed into, to him. Wait, wait, what? Yeah. So when I mean the angel. Well, considering how far the Char Council has gone to frame war, and pretty much put you on an, a wild goose chase or something. I'm putting past them to try to sab. Oh. Well, my journey was like a complete and total loss. What? <sighs> Let's just say I'm the reason why the humans are back. What? I, uh, I made, uh, a bargain, technically. What? Hey, 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 before you say anything, it's... Okay, what kind of bargain could you have made? <laughs> you really want to know? You see, you tell me now or else I make it so you can't have kids ever. I'll make it so you can't laugh ever. I will peel back your eyelids and cut them off. So you can never get a good night's sleep. Ever. Okay. <clears throat> if anything, I traded the lives of our fallen brethren for the lives of the humans. What? And then she looks. You're right. Wait, but the crow father. Yeah, they those uh. That drove him crazy. With all their voices, they wouldn't shut up. <laughs> yeah, I can believe that. Oh, yeah, that sounds like something they could do. I mean, they don't have bodies anymore, thanks to us. Especially you, Ken. 
Slayer. <sighs> what? I strike a nerve. Was... Yeah, yeah, I know you don't like being called that, but... Eh, it just rolls off the tongue, you know? Yeah, but Kinslayer... Ugh, that makes you sound like a terrible person. Well, you pretty much betrayed everyone within our family tree. Uh. <sighs> oh, okay. Yes, I haven't ha been the best when it comes to... Whatever. If anything, things happen. I had no choice. Oh no, you had a choice. You just chose to, you know, side with the charge council, as did we. Heck, the balance had to be preserved, so we signed up. If anything, we all made the choice. We all have blood on our hands. The only thing is, for some reason, it really stuck with you. And again, you are death. And then Yuzuku just falls to his knees and clutches his head. He's like, uh, what's wrong with you this time? We are not carrying you if you fall completely unconscious. No, there's this voice. I hear it. It, along with hooves galloping what yeah this is saying come find me help me no way what uh, oh that's so unfair huh what are you talking about? You get to talk to your horse, but I don't get to talk to mine anymore. What? Oh, don't you play dumb. That's ruin your hearing. Uh, really? As is, as I was. Wait, you've been hearing galloping, you say? Yeah. Huh, that's weird. I just chopped that up to nonsense, or, you know, someone just being on a horse or something. I never care enough to really look into it. <sighs> now you, wait, you can hear despair? Yeah. What about you, Strife? Mayhem? <sighs> you can hear Mayhem, can't you? Yeah. <sighs> I'm sorry, sis. I know how much you loved, you know, Rampage. He was one of the greatest horses there ever was. <laughs> I'm sorry, what's so funny? Oh, nothing, it's just... No, nothing kind of biased. No, it, it seems very legitimate and justified. If anything, chances are I would've chosen him over any of you any day of any hour any minute second I would choose to save him over one of you assholes probably you death so I can take over mm. that's not how someone gets the leadership role oh please if I fight you then the role is instantly mine. 
actually, I think you would be sorely mistaken. I'm stronger than any of you. <laughs> you're the youngest, therefore you're the weakest. So chances are... Heck, I think even Strife can body you solo. Really? If they're arguing back and forth, that was pretty much like, oh my god, I, it's like raising children. Uh, either way, yeah, I think I'm going to go look for my horse. At least I have mine. Just leaving it at that as, yeah, you can tell Fury, at least Miracle, is pissed over this. But she can, like, he's right. <sighs> I lost my noble steed in battle. Uh, the way it should be, but <sighs> I need to be sure that the Charred Council had something to do with this. <sighs> yeah, it doesn't matter. You can look for your proof wherever you want. If anything, I'm going to get some more of my equipment. I suggest you you all do the same. And Jizuku's already gone. Like, what? Where are you going? To get my horsey! Okay, so he's dealing with that. What about you, Strife? Eh, I can already sell my horse, so if anything, I need to get my guns. Oh, yes. I know. They're, they're just... Waiting to be shot again. They're calling me. They want to come home to daddy. Okay. So. While we were getting our stuff. Why don't you just. And she's already gone. You know she barely listened to you. Or any of us. Yes, but she's still our sister, a horseman. Anyway, see you. As yes, Izuku is pretty much on foot, running at full speed, trying not to exhaust his stamina, but also trying to cover as much ground as possible. And this is when he realizes something's off. His bond with Ruin is pretty much wavering every so often to a point where it's just screaming in his head to a point where it's barely a whisper. Hmm. Almost like someone's there watching. Probably observing, trying to see what he does next. Him just being a okay, okay. So someone wants to mess with me, huh? Okay, that, that that's fine. That's great. It's not like they're pissing me off. Yeah, it's not like they're going. They're uh, toying with someone who's a sadistic asshole. <laughs> Loki. Ghost. <clears throat> but he decides to entertain them. Just look like he's wandering blindly to the point where he hears the screaming of Ruin's voice echoing throughout his head and runs straight towards the noise where he sees a large structure looking similar to a Coliseum. The well, I'm guessing I'm going in there. The only thing is, he's very cautious. Though, yes, he wants to be reunited with Ruin, he also doesn't want to end up getting murdered. Hopefully, he can do both. Just then, the door, the gate, is slammed shut. Him pretty much having no choice but to move forward as he hears roaring of crowded seats 
pretty much like, well, look who it is. The Horseman War, here to get his little pony. Mm. Fucking demons. I have no quarrel with you. I've only come for my steed. Oh, yes. We know. We, we, we know that for sure. The thing is, we've got attached to the beast. If you want him, I'm afraid you're gonna have to fight for him. 